Hey Spuddies, it's Sai coming back at you again with another video. I know it's been a minute, but I'm going to make it up to you by introducing a special new segment of the channel that I would like to call Potato Tuesday. Now, you might be wondering, Spuddy? Potato Tuesday? What's going on? Well, maybe I never said this before, but I run the Georgia Tech Spud Lab. Uh, so Spud stands for Security, Privacy, Usability, and Design. So I thought it would only be apropos for this particular channel to also be reflective of my broader potato security related research. So Potato Tuesday, very simple format. We're going to be cooking, baking, making something potato related. And as we go through the steps of that recipe, I'm gonna be asking a guest, heard that right, it's not just me anymore, it's gonna be a guest too. We're gonna to be asking that guest questions about whatever, you know, uh, their research, their background, anything else really, I don't know. So uh, this week, uh, we're very fortunate to have my first PhD student ever, Young Wook Do, join us as our guest. Now, unfortunately, my microphone did sort of conk out at various points in this video, and so we weren't able to capture all of his answers to the questions that I asked. That's okay though, that just gives me a excuse to make another video sometime in the future to capture some of these uh, answers that he was not able to provide in this particular video. So you can look forward to that. Um, but with that said, I hope you enjoy the first and maybe last because it was actually pretty complicated to do this. But please enjoy Potato Tuesday. All right, so we got all our ingredients together. Uh, look at it, doesn't it look good? Oh yeah, yeah, so, that's great. Uh, well, are you ready for another question? Of course. All right, so, you know, before you came to the Spud Lab, you mentioned you liked doing research. Of course, that's what we do in the Spud Lab. Mm -hmm. You did stuff that I would categorize as very cool, but pretty different from what we do mm. in the Spud Lab, right? Like with cybersecurity. And exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, but I was just wondering, like, what made you decide to go into the Spud Lab and like sort of pivot to cybersecurity? Yeah. Um, so yeah, I did a lot of uh, uh, tangible interface-related uh, research before, yep. uh, like um, like food and also like paper, a lot of like interesting stuff. Uh -huh. But since like you introduced the cybersecurity area in terms of tangible interface, I uh, started getting interested in this area mm -hmm. mainly because uh, my uh, the reason that I uh, really like the uh, the concept of tangible interface is that the tangible interface is the tool to uh, that can bridge the uh, the physical world and then the virtual world. Yeah. Um, yeah. So. And also, I, I think that the cybersecurity area is a really important uh, area for people. Um, I think they should care about it mm -hmm. um, because it is really important. <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. Uh, but uh, since they don't actually I want, <laughs> they don't want to care about that much since it is annoying, it is irritating, yeah. um, it's not like like enjoyable. Uh, be, um, daily uh, routine uh -huh. so I think like a bridging the gap between like physical world and then virtual world would um, help people to yeah. get encouraged to care more about the cybersecurity yeah. so that's my uh, vision that I got inspired inspired by uh, right. your direction yeah that's really cool so yeah of course your your vision of tangible computing uh, merge with cybersecurity is one of the reasons why I wanted to recruit you as a PhD student mm -hmm. and uh, let me tell you guys, so far he's not let me down. <laughs> gotta wait, because that's question number three. First, we gotta beat uh, these ingredients together. Let's Are you ready this. for that? Yes, <laughs> yes, of course. been introduced to it. Mm. So I think as people uh, get more um, like a, interested and in, like a careful about the usability design of cybersecurity system, I think there will be a more fun, maybe interesting or effective way um, to like a use the cybersecurity system. Alright, 
Let's put these in. Awesome. So, while we're doing that, mm -hmm. well, what's your favorite part of Georgia Tech in Atlanta? Georgia Tech. So yeah. So the. That'd be good. Yeah, one of the the reasons that I um, decided to come to Georgia Tech is that. So if you are looking for any collaboration opportunities, uh, there will be someone actually you can find very easily. Um, because a lot of faculty, a lot of research labs are doing something that you might be interested in already. So uh, if you find, if you want to find someone uh, who works in that area, you can find it at Georgia Tech. Um, yeah, that is the... We can do that. Yeah, we can do that. If you want to change the world, you're at Georgia Tech. You can do that. If you want to build the Iron Man suit, you're at Georgia Tech. You can do that. <laughs> that is the actually most um, important factor for me to uh, decide to come here. Uh, in Atlanta, uh, it's a bit hot. <laughs> <laughs> said your favorite part. Yeah, it's, a, favorite it's part. a literally hot place. <laughs> but actually, I enjoyed this hot weather. Also, at the same time, um, actually, fall, winter, and spring, the weathers are really nice, actually. <laughs> so, so, yeah, I'm not exaggerating. So, um, I think if you're worried about weather, uh, you don't have to be worried about that much. But, um, but please know that summer is a bit hot. <laughs> That's all I can say. It's like, it's like one of the faculty members at Carnegie Mellon up in Pittsburgh told me when I complained about it being too cold in Pittsburgh. He's just like, <laughs> stay indoors, wear a jacket when you're outdoors, whatever. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, here, please get inside the building. <laughs> it's really cold. Plus the AC, will be fine. Yeah. <laughs> Check it out. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh man, that looks legit. I don't know how it's gonna taste. Okay. okay. <laughs> I I trust how it looks. Are you sure you can do it? <laughs> be okay. nice. I don't want to be liable for burning my feet. Oh. <laughs> wow. Looks good. Looks really good. I don't know Seriously. How it looks good. 